After a long day of being an essential worker, it's nice to kick back, relax, and look at some good quality social media posts. Let's see what the internet has in store for us tonight. Hey, since we're all trapped in our houses for the foreseeable future, let's all play a game. Uh, I spy with my low eye something red in your most recent photos. Uh, post it below now. Breaking news! A famous celebrity, Betty Boop, has contracted COVID-19. We're sure this is very upsetting for all of her fans, but we're all praying for her speedy recovery. Day 12 of quarantine. I swept into a fui today. I have not left bed yet. Uh, next episode. Listen, I am not a hoarder, but Target is limiting me to only one pack of toilet paper per customer, and I am willing to trade wine and Purell in order to complete my shaman collection. Oh, I caught a sea bass. No wait, it's at least a C plus. This virus is a scam by my opponents and the elites to take power over you and mess up the economy. But don't worry, you'll all be back to work by Easter. It's unethical for them to keep charging us rent while they've taken away our income. It's immoral. It's wrong. Viva la revolution, baby! Viva la revolution! This is so relaxing. See, this is what I love about social media. Every day it's a new and different thing. Let's keep scrolling and see what other new things we can find. The only thing I love more than toilet paper itself is mocking those too foolish to start buying up all the toilet paper before this all started. Well, I'm out of a job, but at least this bed is comfy. Hey, that reminds me of a game. Post 10 jobs that you've had in the past, but one of them is a lie. Ooh, see if people can figure it out. <laughs> May I offer you an egg in this trying time? During this time, we must all be social distancing. I hereby close absolutely everything. If you leave your house, you will be fined. Wait, but you were out there shaking hands with everyone at church yesterday. You should be fined with a guillotine. This just in, virus contraction rates appear to be spiking all over the globe, but especially where you specifically live. Oh man, that was a little similar to what we looked at just a minute ago, but I loved it just as much the second time. Even if this is all social media is now, for forever, I don't think I'll ever get tired of it. Here's a quiz to see how well you know me. <laughs> Guys, look at this bug I got. Someone bring me snacky snack. Up next, a conspiracy. Is toilet paper actually helping the virus spread? You betrayed me? Remember, this is all China's fault. Remember, this is all actually his fault. How is your island so much more developed than mine? You must be cheating. Hee <laughs> hee. I'm a little kitty cat. I sweep all day and I bark at car wides. Heartwarming. An elderly woman diagnosed with the virus decides to not accept care as she thinks it would be better suited for younger people who weren't going to die anyway. That's... We labeled that as heartwarming? Is, the, is that a real story? What the... You should all be doing more to make this system work. You're a slave to your capitalist gods, and every second you breathe promotes corruption. Pop quiz! What's your bank account and routing number? I may die, but I will die shiny and clean. Is time even real? Don't you want to play a game with your friends? Don't you miss them? How can I still owe more? I've given everything I have. I no longer crave food. I crave only toilet paper. Breaking news. Real life is a dystopia. There's so much noise, but I feel so alone. Uh -huh. Wanna play again?